I'm Melissa Rowland with the Los Angeles Times, and during this lockout, NBA players are doing different things. Some are going to Turkey, others are going to China. Kevin Love is playing volleyball. He's going to struggle. <laughs> no disrespect to Kevin. Uh, he's a great athlete, but uh, those guys play at a high level, and Kevin doesn't. Uh, he hasn't played much. Uh, he can play a little bit, but at, at that level, he's going to get a... Uh, He's gonna struggle a little bit. Uh, why volleyball? Well, you know, the Jose Cuervo Beach Volleyball Series just kind of came to me. It was, uh, you know, something that, you know, my dad always talked about. He always wanted me playing uh, beach volleyball. He's always saying, you know, why aren't you getting out to the sand? Why aren't you getting your sand leg? So, you know, finally I just decided to get out here. It was a good fit for me because, you know, a lot of the intangibles fit a basketball player as they do with uh, a beach volleyball player being, you know, tall, relatively athletic, being able to move side to side and, you know, having good touch. So. You know, for me, it was a, I wouldn't say an easy transition because these guys, I mean, get, after getting out here in the sand, I, you know, respect them at the, uh, the highest level now. But it is, uh, you know, it was a game that I felt I could, if I, you know, put in the time, put in the practice, that I could get out there and, you know, be pretty good at. So you can tell your dad you definitely have your sand legs. <laughs> De definitely got my sand legs, as you can see. Got the multi-tone, yeah. Yeah, I got my sand legs for sure. So I was diving around, getting in the sand a little bit, just trying to get used to, you know, being out there. But that takes time. These guys have put in, uh, you know, countless hours of work. So, I mean, I give them a tremendous amount of respect. And, you know, this, this, this sport is no joke. So I've been out here for an hour. You're an NBA all-star. And you've been taking a lot of instruction. <laughs> yeah. I'm coachable. I'm coachable. I had, I had, uh, I had Coach Rambis uh, the past two years. Now I got a new Coach Rambis and Jesse. So it was, uh, you know, good for these guys to, you know, be teaching me. And I just try to be as cerebral as possible, be a sponge, and, and really soak everything in because, you know, they had a lot of good things to say. And like I said, I'm not trying to embarrass myself too bad out there. Is he uh, the Charles Barkley to golf of, a volleyball? of volleyball? You could say that. I don't, I mean, he only played a couple points on our team, but uh, I mean, he, he looks like he can play a little bit, but it's, you know, it's, Deceptive. Yeah, it's the difference between, you know, someone that plays basketball at the rec center and someone that plays in the NBA. And he's, he's trying to play, he's trying to play, uh, he's trying to play professional volleyball against guys that do it for a living. Dang. Luke Wallen called me out like that? Yeah, at the six man. See, if, the thing is, I'm not afraid to put myself out there. I look at different guys and you know, you just got to have fun with it. Life brings you new experiences. So, you know, for me, um, yeah, six man was a little different. I'd only played two twos before. So, um, you know, to get out there in six man is a little different for me. Had to get the rotations down. Didn't really know what I was getting myself into. So, yeah, Luke could say that he was, he, he was, uh, he was right. He was right. I didn't look too good out there that day. What's good about your game? What still needs some work? What's your assessment? Well, I was ranking it today. I was, I was saying, okay, striking and hitting the ball is uh, probably at the top. And then, um, you know, probably setting the ball and then uh, blocking uh, and then serving and then passing. So I need to really need to work on the passing because that could be the most uh, you know, important aspect uh, in, beat, I mean, in any form of volleyball uh, in most cases. So for me, I have a lot to work on. And like I mentioned, I'm not trying to go out there. I mean, I'm trying to go out there and play as best I can, but I'm not looking to, to win the tournament. I'm looking to go out there, have a good time, uh, you know, represent Jose Cuervo and, and play, some, play some good volleyball and not embarrass myself too bad, like I mentioned.